Hello, Dear Nerdigans. This is the one and only Packer Girl 89. Today's Mom and Nerdigan Live reaction video is going to be for Dr. Stone Chapter 160. And last chapter, sniper attack happened. Senku got shot. But the very last second, he made a homemade bulletproof vest. Um, but we don't know if he survived or not. It looked like he got injured from the impact. But we don't don't know to what extent so anyway without further ado let's get to this chapter and find out um what is in store for us this week a gunshot and it's coming right at us no bullets move faster than sound it's already hit it's over S senku in chapter 160 is titled torch of science and there he is, that motherfucker Stan. Job's done. The enemy science leader is dead. You two hang uh, back and keep watch. But what about Miss Luna? Leave her. Help her. Your choice. Not my problem. <laughs> Stan is such a dick. God damn it. Miss Luna. What do I do now? No, they, they killed Sanku. God, you don't know if they killed Sanku. Jesus Christ. Um, keep it together, everyone. They're, um, they're thinking with Senku, the science leader, gone, those kids can never hope to match us in battle. Now we'll slowly squeeze the fight out of them until they surrender. Now's our chance to strike back. Well, yeah, Ryasui's right. Now's our chance to strike back while the enemy is overconfident. Am I wrong? Sure you ain't wrong. It might be our chance, but how, how we can move, just move on from this. If nothing else, we gotta dig a grave for Senku. Ha, don't bury him just yet. <laughs> I ain't dead, dummies. The fragment passed right through me nice and clean. <laughs> See? He ain't dead. Nice and clean, says Master Senku. Um, oh, don't force yourself to talk, buddy. You need to rest. Yes, he's a... Like, forgive me my lord uh shout, shouting loud enough for the enemy to hear is it why seriously you fucking dumbass god so this slowed the bullet down this bag had some water yes it did oh well isn't that something a headshot would have meant 10 billion percent instant death for oh sorry a headshot would have um, meant 10 billion percent instant death. For all they know, I was the only one with the revival fluid re recipe uh, memorized. So they probably wanted to give me a chance to spill uh, the secret on my deathbed. That's uh, how I knew they'd aim for the chest. Fucking sneaky assholes. Didn't I tell you to, uh, to stop talking? Aim for the chest, he said. And now in English, a headshot would have resulted in instant death. Real time translation, that's nuts. Well, that's Francois for you. Amazing to keep his wits about him like that. In the middle of a crisis. Ah, he's out cold. His wounds must be pretty nasty. I've administered basic first aid, but anything further requires a trained medical professional. Mm, I really remember this stuff, but... Squeeze the upper arm and, like so, and the pulse in, um, in his wrist goes away. If the pulse stops from a light squeeze, that means low blood pressure. If it takes a light uh, grip to make the pulse stop, that means high blood pressure. That's one way I learned to do this. Blood pressure's dropping. Luna, are you a doctor? Who? Me? No way! Uh, obviously not. I'm just a kid. I'm just a medical student. Wait a minute, what?! I'll become a capable gal and, fi and find um, a happening brainy dude to be my BF. Uh, but see, I only got into school because of my dad's connections. I worked my butt off in class and so nobody could say anything about that. Not that I understood a thing. I was the only one who failed and had to repeat a year. Please, please, Luna, we have no one else. Senku, our good buddy Senku, you gotta save him. Ah, oh, crap, no matter how we sneak over there, they're bound to see us coming. They'll rain arrows down on us. Well, they're not going to rain arrows on you. They're going to rain bullets on you. That's a completely different thing. Arrows I might be able to handle, but the machine gun crossfire will kill us on the spot. Um, let's see. Dang, that's right. We're dealing with another science kingdom here. Oh, ha, we've reached some top-notch reinforcements! Yes! Yes, they're here! Jen's trail of flowers. 
Rose Lettuce right here. Yay! Oh, God. We got some good reinforcements here. I might suggest sneaking through the cornfields at night, but, hmm, we'll still be too exposed. Wouldn't work. Using the lake would uh, give us, uh, get us close, but there's still too little cover. Once we've infiltrated the enemy fortress, we should have the advantage in close combat, but the problem then is that we have to grab the enemy boss, Dr. Zeno, and make our way out. We'll have to dig. Indeed. Dig? Mm-hmm. That's right. A reverse Great Escape! We're digging a subterranean tunnel! Uh, right into the heart of the enemy! Dude, I fucking love this robot. Inagaki, I fucking love you. And also, I, I'm sorry. Inagaki, I love your writing, but I meant to say Boichi. Boichi, I'm sorry. I meant to say I love your art, Boichi. Boichi, I love your art this week. I love this robot. It is bomb. But I gotta say this, Boichi. I'm, I'm probably gonna have to tweet Boichi some of, uh, some of Murata's art that we saw a couple of days ago. Because, Boichi, you're gonna have to step the fuck up again. Bad, bad! That sounds like a lot of work. We'll have to have Senku for a plethora of science items for this, um, excavation job. Heck yeah! Speaking of, incoming from the, per um, uh, Perseus, uh, 43, 32, 33... What are these strange numbers? Is Ryasui messing around? Um, it's the, uh, Usegi cipher. Kenshin Usegi's, uh, code system is a remarkably si uh, simple concept. Each pair of numbers points to an element of the Japanese sil uh, syllabary. This Dr. Zeno may know his stuff, but I can't imagine a non-Japanese knowing the, um, uh, Iroha poem sequence. <laughs> it's a pretty an analog... Uh, analog code compared to what the enemy's packing. Simple but effective, right? Still, we have to keep our messages short or risk giving them um, enough content to, cr uh, to crack the code. Seiko's been shot by a sniper! Oh, wait, it's okay, he's alive! So, um, the numbers 43, 30, and this is the translation note, by the way. The numbers 43, 32, 33 is code for uh, Utare, and Utare means shot in Japanese, by the way. Still, tunneling is in is our only option. You mean without science? Got a message from Sanku. Just three characters. 471242. Kuromu. Uh, Chrome. Um, I'm not a sorcerer anymore. What, uh, what are we gonna uh, make, um, uh, next with science? It's calcite. It's cal- wait, it's calcite. There we go. Whatever crazy situation humanity finds itself in, um, scientists are 10 billion percent sure to pop up. Uh, hold on, it's got it. Um, here we go. There will always be people greedy enough to want to know every last detail about, uh, how the world works. You gotta realize it, Dr. Chrome. The scientist now is you. Yeah! It's all up to Chrome! It's all up to Chrome! The torch! I see what the torch, what, what the title means. I see what you did here, Inagaki. The torch is being passed because... It's all up to Chrome. The torch of science has been passed. It's all up, well, for now. For now, the torch of science has been passed. And that's probably what I'm going to put in parentheses. <laughs> it's for now. But yes, the torch of science has been passed for now uh, to Chrome because, you know, Senku is out of commission. Uh, but the thing I found interesting was about Luna. Luna is definitely coming to our side for sure. Oh, damn straight she is. But I'm really curious what you guys thought of this chapter. I love that we got the cavalry here. I think they made it here on time, or just at the perfect timing. Um, curious what's going to happen now. Obviously, Chrome's this is uh, um, this is going to be interesting to see how Chrome comes up with the schematics and everything else. Uh, we've seen Chrome, you know, step up to the occasion when need be, but this is going to be Chrome's biggest test yet. Anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below, and remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigan Zinc if you love what I'm doing and want to help keep this uh, channel alive so I can keep bringing you more um, Dr. Stone content. There's a few ways you could do that. You donate to my Cash App, PayPal, Patreon, GoFundMe, purchase something off my Amazon wishlist, all that's in the description box below. Um, also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, friend me on PlayStation Network, that's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later.